Joining us tonight is Adoni Media Managing Director, Lisa Goddard. Lisa, what a night. Farewell to the Spin King. It was a moving memorial at the G and it's been captured beautifully by his hometown paper, The Herald Sun, with the headline, headline King of the G. Warney, the cricketer, star and fan, would have loved it. At the G, he felt like a gladiator in a coliseum and his family said last night there was no better place to farewell the legend and mate to Victorians, Australians and people from across the world. It's what he would have wanted, his father Keith said. Now on to the Australian with the headline pies, beers, bangers and a little spin Bold Shane, a state memorial service for Shane Warne. Where did that come from? The mister, perhaps, in the name, and it looked out like a plane without an honorific. Perhaps the state was catching up with having to fail to acknowledge him in life. After all, it's Border AO, Taylor AO, War AO, NASA Hassan, OBE, Brian Lara, TC, OCC, AM, and as we learned, Sir Elton John, CH and CBH. Warney FA hardly seems right in that context. Lise, it was a beautiful send-off. I I thought his beautiful children, uh, Brooke, Summer and Jackson, spoke absolutely beautifully. And I think the, uh, the Oz headline really takes the cake for me tonight. Yeah, Jenna, I watched the, the memorial service and look how many of these events have we attended as reporters and in the media. And this one was really uplifting. It, there wasn't, obviously there was that, that, the sadness and the fact that he's now, we've now lost this incredible sportsman from this country. But it was nice to see that there was, there was this, it was a celebration. It, it wasn't so much a mourning and a loss. I know it, it's been a month now, so people have had some time to come to terms with it. But what I really liked was that you actually saw the fact of if you didn't know Warney as, as a cricket fan, if you weren't into cricket, uh, it was someone that everybody in Australia knew of, whether it was through some trashy women's magazine that had the latest pap shot of him, or, like I said, if you're a sports fan. And tonight, we really got to look into who he was. And, you know, the funny stories about him, you know, speeding around in his Ferrari to do you know, the, the, uh, <laughs> the drive with someone who'd won a kindergarten raffle, or the fact that he was, you know, working with the United Nations. I didn't know that. It was, it yeah, was quite phenomenal yeah. to watch. And... We really have lost someone quite special. Yeah, I thought uh, the fact that his children, uh, he'd have such a, a beautiful legacy on them, just basically teaching them, you know, good manners cost nothing and uh, if you're happy, then you'll always, good things will always happen. If only every kid in Australia could have 10% of what Warney gave to his children, I think would be much better off for it. So, Vale to the great yeah. man. I look forward to uh, all, the, all of the, uh, everyone getting around his kids and his family to, while they're going through this really tough time.